Hey guys, Ryan Austin had to go, so this is part 12 of my VHS collection just with me, 2020 edition. Let's get right on it. Last uh, last VHS collection video for a couple hours, and maybe I'll do another one at like 1 or 2 a.m. I'll do the next part. The Thornbirds, this is a four volume set. Part four. All the all these have the exact same per date. November 17, 1993, and all four of these. Same per date. Tape. Another tape my grandma gave me was this one. Alright. I'll keep that for the Wonder Bros. TG Shield collection. Commercials, commercials from around the world. Ink label, no per date, from MPI Home Video. Dirty Dancing, by the way, guys, we're doing now over there. We got to that shelf. I already previously did these two right here. And then we'll do that one in part 13, the top one right there. And we'll, we'll get to the... Clamshells, like I said, very last in cup boxes. Dirty Dancing. No per date. Never Say Never Again with Sean Connery. No MGM logo right there. It's absent. Uh, September 6, 2000. Iron Eagle 2. Property of Farm... Far more ink. Per date says, let me see. February 10th, 1989, and no, we can year code. Per, just a per date from February 10th, 1989. All right, we got RKO collection, flying leather necks, Turner Armor Tannant, Avon, no print date. Close Cars of the Third Kind, Special Edition, Good Times. This does have the obvious Good Times ending at the end. We got Advice and Consent. This movie, I mean, this VHS starts abruptly. Alright, we got The Man Who Loved Cat Dancing. January 23rd, 2002. Alright, we got Dark Blue with Kurt Russell, United Artists, June 17th, 2004, Miracle on 34th Street, Toys Fox Holiday Classic, Single Label, Wash Gap Printings, 44, Thick and Nice Night 3, Aaron, Eric Brockovich, I mean Aaron Brockovich, not Eric, <laughs> silly me, Single Label, printed in the 28th week of 2000. These tapes fell, but we'll get to these next, since they fell. Demo tape of Undeadly Ground. April 28th, 1994. Rare tape. And that's my other for my other uh, non-demo copy of Presumed Innocent. Sick label. September 22nd, that's I was, and September 21st, that's I won. Pretty only a day apart. Secret Window with Johnny Depp. Uh, 13th to get to that on 5. I was almost, I almost said 12th, but no, it's 13th week. I corrected myself. The Turn of the Screw. Live on video. Uh, the top's really bent. I don't know if I can get back in there. The top's like really bent. Bent pretty badly. There, got it. Thirtieth week of nineteen ninety three. Previously viewed Sahara Canon Films release. I regret ruining the end label of this one. I regret it. Ah well. Video Street opened three hundred sixty five days. 
more copies of new releases, more game selection, five-day rental of most movies, and movie reservations. The Mirror's Two Faces. I believe it's my CHC copy. Yeah, it is. Stick a label. September 2nd, 1998. We got Trapped. Stick a label. Printed in the 21st week of 2003. Mr. Deeds. Vertical Ink Label. It's a Canadian copy. August 21st, 2002. I Love Lucy's Zany Road Trip. California, Here We Come. Part 1 of 2. Has three tapes in there. Part 1, Part 2, Part 3. Part 1 was printed in the 41st week of 1998 with Yellow Side of Barco, but still has nothing at the end. Part 2, 44th week of 1998. And Part 3, 46th week of 1998. And here is Part 2 of 2. Three more tapes. One, Part 2, and Part 3. And all three have the same week in year code from the 45th week of 1998. Invincible Demo Tape. Ink Label. January 23rd, Town 3, and January 14th, Town 3. Miramax Demo. Santa Claus of Tim Allen. Ox 29th, 1995. Great American Cartoons. Made in Hong Kong. Bridget Jones, The Edge of Reason. Corporate to Miramax, The Working Title. Sig Label. Sam Thicke, 2005. I don't see Harvey Weinstein on the back. Or his brother. Too Fast, Too Furious. Sig Label, Black Reels. 20th Thicke, 2004. I mean, 20th Thicke, 2002. And... I believe it was, if I remember correctly, I think the other week of Yerko was the 34th to get to down for. If I remember correctly. Bram Stoker's Dracula. Which has our hologram label. Green Sire Barco, but nothing at the end. 22nd week of 1993. My Girl, blockbuster date, May 3rd, 2006. This tape is a little bit damaged. 11th week of 1995. Truth or Consequences NM. When you're running on fear, don't stop for gas. Promotional copy not for sale or rental. Triumph Films. No per date or recon year code. The Mystic Masseur. Masseur. School label. Hollywood video M label. Third week of 2003. May in Manhattan. 30th week of Town 4 in the 46th week of 1996. Recycle tape. Tears the Sun. Still label. 35th week of 2004. Oops. Didn't mean for that to happen. Spider Man. Still label. 37th week of 2002. That's my first copy. 51st dates. Sony reprint. This is my copy. It's a little bit damaged. 11th week of 2005 and the 34th week of 1996. Recycle from Paramount Tape. I'm guessing Mission Impossible. It's probably the tape. Alright. <clears throat> now let's get to some more. Hollywood High Part 2. That's from Video Big V. Stick a label. No print date. Midway. Label, label, 37 thick in 1991. Watch get up printings. I don't really care for this film much anymore, but I'll keep it for collection purposes. Like you to some as Pride, Caseless 1998 VHS. September 17, 1998. We got King Ralph, Bible's Date, November 17, 1998. Stick a label, end label, watch get up printings. 28 thick in 1991. Alright, we got. 2005 VHS of Charlie Chocolate Factory, John Depp. Not as good as Willy Wonka, but it's still an okay film. Include Black Reels. October 11, 2005. Gremlins 2005 reprint. Very rare. Include Black Reels. July 18, 2005. Johnny McNormick. Canadian copy.
Peacemaker. Inkable, February 25th, 1998. Oh boy, this next movie is a disgrace to filmmaking. Battlefield Earth with John DeVolta. This film is garbage. I'm only going to keep it for the collection purposes. Yeah, I got Battlefield Earth only for one reason. Blockbuster date says October 15th, 2008. And it has this newer security device enclosed thing. They use, I guess, in 2008 or something. Ink label, December 5th, 2000. I got only for that. Film is garbage. I hate the movie. Empire Records. Corporate producer Regency. May 14th, 1999. Per exactly two years before I was born. Murder by Numbers, Sandra Bullock. Here's my other copy. September 3rd, 2002. I'll keep this for backup. Whoops. I dropped it. Didn't mean to. Here's another caseless tape, Madeline. My first copy. 46 week in 1998. Outlaw Josie Wales. August 7, 2000. This was my grandma's, but she gave it to me. Exclusives. This is executive decision. Dark Circle label. No per date. Still has Gigi Shield at the beginning. Wrongfully accused. Sticker label. White screen of death printings. Oops. Didn't mean to drop that. At least it was Battlefield Earth. Amadeus special white screen edition. Ink label. March 23rd, 1998. We got Star Trek A Mock Time. Episode 34. 46 week of 1985. Wonder Bros. Hits. Murder in the First. November 30th, 1998. Insom Insomnia. Cobra's Alcon. September 6th, Town 2, and August 31st, Town 2. Terminator 3, Spanish VHS. Dark Circle Label. January 15th, 2004. Pure Luck. Two label, end label, watch your printings. Fifth week of 1992. Next up, All the President's Men. Canadian copy, December 3rd. 1996, CBC. Out of Africa. Reprint from the 40, no, the 26th week in 1998. Goodbye, New York. Best on video, Big V. No per date or recon year code. Former rental from Family Video Entertainment Center in Quincy, Massachusetts. Wow, that's far away from where I live. Shrek 2, French Canadian. Yeah, it's French Canadian. Ink label, per date September 8th, 2004. Pretty rare tape. The Cat in the Hat. Box date, December 9th, four. This is a slipcover copy. Cobra's to DreamWorks Imagine. 9th, we get to down 4. K Pax. Blockers date May 28, 2002. Covers to Ender Media and Lawrence Golden Productions. Lar Lawrence. Is it? Yeah, is it Lawrence? Yeah, it's Lawrence Go Gordon Productions, I think. Single label, Blockers to End label, 8th of 2002. Star Trek Space Seed, episode number 24. Single label, End label, 45th week of 1985. Oversized reels. The Vanishing. 22nd week in that tie 3, and the 48th week in that tie 5. Another recycle tape. Demo tape of Tall Tale. Vertical Circle Label, June 6, 1995. Havana. 45th week of 2000. Also, is Universal 70. Oh, wait, is it the 75 years one? 
Oh, no, it isn't. I I mean, or, or, yeah, it is, actually. Sorry, yeah, it is. Biker Boys, fully screening cassette. From DreamWorks Home Entertainment. March 14, Town 3, and February 14, Town 3. Exactly a month apart. Always widescreen edition. Circle label. 53rd week in 1999, and the 37th week in 1997. The Jackal. Circle label. 8th week of 2000. Little Women comes with this case. Pretty interesting. Stick a label. Recycle tape. Six week in 1997 and the 36th week in 1995. I know they also made a Town 19 reboot of Little Women, which I still have yet to see. I actually pre-ordered that the DVD of that one. I should be getting it. I'm not gonna spoil it, but it's actually not from America. It's from an. It's actually for. It's actually uh, a PAL disc from a different country. I'm not gonna spoil which country. Vertical single label, June 16, 1997. Still has Chigi Shield at the beginning. Addicted to Love, full screen and cassette. Vertical single label, August 5, 1997. Police Academy 2, their first assignment. Vertical sticker label. Print date here is. Hang on a minute. Oh, come on. There. March eleventh, nineteen eighty seven. All right. Gremlins 2, the new batch. Property of Pharmacy, Farm, Farm something, Inc. November 18th, 1990 and November 15th, 1990. Three days apart. Executive action. February 1st, 1992 and November 22nd, 1991. Pretty kind of far apart. Jeremiah Johnson. Purple Sigle Label. September 3rd, 1992, and August 28th, 1992. Pretty six days apart. Caddy Shack. September 11th, 1988, and September 3rd, 1988. Eight days apart. Fallen. Ink Label. No print date. City of Angels, Sticker Label, Watch Good Death Printings, Star Trek The Mangari Parts 1 and 2, Episode 16, 21st week of 1985, pretty early pressing, obviously. Hook, Sticker Label, Mowing Sound Only, 28th week of 1992. Mixed Nuts, Steve Martin. 23rd week of 1995. U571, there was a special edition. 16th week of Town 1. I also have the UK VHS of U571, which I'll show in another part. Fatal Attraction. I also have the rare demo tape of this, which I'll show in another part. The demo VHS is from 1988. It's printed in the second week of 1989. Oh, wait, does that have Watch Good Death and Morning Sound? Let me check. I think this is my Watch Good Death and Morning Sound copy. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. The Big Man Crossing the Line. Single label, end label. February 27th, 1992, and the 11th of 1992. Cable Guy. I have another copy somewhere. 8th of Town 2 and 23rd of 1998. It's a recycle tape. Metal Lion Spanish subtitled. Single label. 49th of Town 3. Destry rides again. Gene Charlotte's Critics Choice. Single label, end label. Second week of 1990. Michael. Single label, August 9th, 1997. The Thin Blue Line. Single label, March 1st, 1991. February 19th, 1991. Reindeer Games. My Solanus. It's a Dimension movie. Ink label. 
Hmm, it has a Saturn N label, like Saturn the car. They, I mean, the cartridge number is 44 out of 64. We got H2O Halloween, 20 years later. Bob today, April 5th, year torn off. April 5th, 1999, or April 5th, 2000, one of those two. Across the Great Divide. Seven Brides for Seven Brothers. August 25th, 1992. Less than zero. This is a reprint from the first week of 2000. Pretty interesting. We got the Ten Commandments. Part one and part two. Blank eight eight at the top of this one and blank eight nine at the top of part two. So I'm guessing that means uh, the eighth week of 1988 and the ninth week of 1988 for part two. Uh, is that right? I, that's just my guess. That's just my guess of what it is. It says blank 88 eight and blank 89, whatever that means. Biloxi Blues, Matthew Broderick. Single label, end label. I think it's the 28th week of 1990. Out of Africa. So label, end label, April 9th, 1990, and the 16th week of 1990. Twister, Dark Side of Nature. Stick a label, December 2nd, time 2. This does have the updated Boring Shield Tape Master. We got the American President, AFI's 100 Years, 100 Passions winner. Stick a label, June 3rd, time 3, May 16th, 2003. Turn on Faith. Ink label, Key Supers Randall number 14, September 24th, 2003. Perfect Murder. Ink label, May 6th, Town 2, and May 3rd, Town 2. Three days apart. The Muppets take Manhattan. January 20th, I mean, no, January 4th, 1992, and the fifth week of 1992. We got Godzilla, Godzilla vs. Space Godzilla. Blue sided, dark blue sided barcode. 48th week in 998. AP mode. This does have watch good at the end. Groundhog Day with Bill Murray. 23rd week in 993. Green sided barcode with nothing at the end. A few good men. Two label. This is an EP mode copy. Dark blue side barcode. 49th week in 1995. Watch your guess that I can only say at the end of that one. All the Pretty Horses this is a Academy Screener copy. Single label. Wicked Year Code is the 53rd week of 2000. Dazed and Confused. Recycle from the Last World Jurassic Park. 37th week of 1997. The 17th week of 2000. The Whistle Boy. So many pictures classics. Single label. First week of 2000. Alright, we got the stuff for wives. Harbors of DreamWorks. Ink label. Jerry 14 Town 6. It's a Town 6 reprint. Hulk. Original Town 3 pressing. Blockbuster 8, December 9th, Town 4. Same as Cat and Hat. Upside down Blockbuster end label. 42nd week of Town 3. This has Silent Mac Vision at the end. King Aron Cop, Universal Comedy Grade, Single Label, 53rd Week of 1998. Ah, oh, man, I dropped the tape. Possession, full length screening cassette, 47th Week of 2002. Let's get Harry. 
HBO and TriStar sticker label. June 27, 1988. The Electric Horseman. Recycled tape. 42nd week of 1996. And the 33rd week of 1994. Somewhere in time. MCA Home Video. Also a clamshell copy of this, which we'll get to later. Don't see a print date on it. Crack in the left lens. Tape still works, I'm sure. Glenn Miller's story. MCA Home Video. Sticker label, end label. July 8th, 1987. And the 30th week of 1987. We got A Perfect Murder. Blackbridge date, March 6, 2001. This is the earlier pressing one. September 8th, 1998. I have two copies of that one. Which I, both of them I showed in this part. Bob's Day, August 4, 1997. This is Sleepers. Single label, previously viewed tape. March 17, 1997. Put on St. Patrick's Day, 1997. Postman. Ink label, number 28, 1998. Has Warner Brothers 75 years offer, but I'm not going to show that right now. Lethal Weapon 4, full length screening cassette. This is a demo tape of Lethal Weapon 4. October 14th, 1999. 1998, I mean. October 14th, 1998. Punisher. I have two copies of this on VHS. Dark sticker label. This this copy is recycled. Um, let me see. Okay, I'm going to need my... I, I can hardly even see it. I'm going to need my light for the print dates. I'm having a hard time seeing it. Uh, I'll try again another day. I'm having a hard time finding a print date on that one. That's a wonderful life, Blockbuster Classics. Let's go ahead and move on. I'm going to get this over with. Number 29, that's 92. Way to Pooh, Playhouse Video. 23rd week of 1996. Too Fast, Too Furious. Another copy. This is the copy I got first. 34th week of Town 3, Home Video End Label. For Richer or Poorer. Sticker Label. Recycle tape, 40th week of 1997, and the 32nd week of 1999. National Lampoon's Animal House. Single label, 33rd week of 2003. We got Along Came Pulley. Single label, 19th week of 2004. This might have Mac Vision at the end, I'm not sure. Black Dog, Patrick Swayze. Box date, February 2nd, 1999. Single label, 39th week of 1998. Notting Hill, Universal Special Edition, single label, 30th to get 2002, Eight and a Half Women, Lionsgate, Bob was 8, March 5th, Town 3, and distributed by Universal, printed the 37th to get 2000. We got Snow Falling on Setters, full length screen copy, single label, 11th to get 2000. Got 17 tapes left. Empire Strikes Back. Brooklyn Sick Label. 30th Thicket 1995. Shrek 2. Copy I got first. Inclo Black Reels. September 30th, Town 4. Also have a UK VHS of this, which we'll get to in another part, like I said. Alphabet Queen. Brooklyn Sick Label. 12th Thicket 1993. Extension in One Breath. X Files. Fifth week of 1997. The Shining. 
Third week of 2000. It's the widescreen edition. Got Fika, Blackbird's Day, August 17th, 2005. Recycled from Ready to Rumble from Warnerverse, which I don't even have that tape yet. February 20th, 2004. Switch. HBO Video and Warner Home Video. I mean, and Warner Brothers. February 21st, 1993, and Jerry 14th, 1993. Probably like a month and a week, a week apart. month and a week apart. Uh, Weeds, HBO, and DEG. Stick a label. April 18th, 1989. Tracks, HBO Video, and DEG again. Stick a label, please rewind tape. August 6, 1988, and August 3, 1988. Three days apart. They got Drums Along the Mohawk, key video. Still a little print date copy. February 25th, 1990. This tape does have the phone noise at the end. Gladiator. And Clover Black Reels, March 8, Town 4. Town 4 reprint. Peacemaker. Spanish copy, December 23rd, 1998, for two days before Christmas, 1998. Devlin, full length screening cassette, with a single label. October 8th, 1992. 48 Hours, special collector's edition. November 18th, 1986, and 6 4 blank, which I'm guessing is the 40th week of 1986. Common Thread, Stories from the Quilt, Sticker Label, August 24th, 1990, August 23rd, 1990, printed day apart. Two more tapes. Oh, wait. Yeah, two more tapes. Close the Cow of the Third Kind, Demo. This tape's only 15 minutes, believe it or not, because it doesn't have the film itself. It just has the making of Close Cow's featurette. That's the only thing on this tape. No, we can hear cut a print date. That's a really weird demo. It only has the making of it. It doesn't have the movie itself. It's only 15 minute long tape. And the last tape for this part is Tank. So July 20th, 1984. See you guys in part 13.